The nation's first 3D printed social housing project is just a month away from construction in Dubbo. Seven News can reveal tonight the state government is pursuing the technology to address a housing crisis. It comes as tenant wait lists continue to soar. First it was used to construct a toilet block. Now it's technology being pursued to deliver social and affordable homes. We want to pull every lever to confront the housing crisis. We want to try everything. The first 3D printed social housing project in the country will be two two-bedroom duplexes on Ronald Street, Dubbo. This is what it is set to look like, providing a place to call home for Aboriginal housing office tenants. For people who are Aboriginal uh, community members in the Dubbo area who desperately need housing. With an estimated project cost of $526,000, builders will use the technology to lay sustainable materials one loop at a time. We use 60% recycled material. There's less waste um, than a conventional build. It's a unique method which aims to cut construction time by about 50%. Compared to the traditional build, which takes around 40 weeks to complete, this 3D printed project will transform this vacant block of land into a brand new home in just 16 weeks. Nearly three months after opening, cracks began appearing on Dubbo's 3D printed amenities block, an issue housing project managers have looked into and resolved. And, and it all comes down to um, expansion joints and articulation joints and that, so that's been designed into the building. We have rigorous standards to ensure that the homes that we are delivering using modern methods of construction are high quality permanent homes. If successful, the 3D printed social housing projects could be rolled out across the state. Hamish Southwell, 7 News.